Dark Knight is a game that's close to my heart. Not only because I make content for it, but because I got invested into the world, its characters, its lore. It's difficult to not become intrigued once you step into those things. I remember returning after not playing for a long time. It felt like coming home and that... That was a nice feeling. My Arknights account is in a comfy place and that... That's the issue. I have nothing to do in Arknights anymore. Yes, I hear you saying that I have M3s and more E2s to do, but I don't wanna. I have no true end goal and that is why everything feels redundant. So I'm going to be quitting. Now before you click away, I have some more to say and it's important. In our podcast, the Kaiser MLG asked me why I feel like making a stream on this because I have mentioned this before on stream. But honestly, at that time, I didn't have the proper answer. I know now why I felt so compelled to share, besides simply giving an update. Tectone leaving Arknights left a bad taste in people's mouths. Everyone was upset and it was a whole ordeal. And I think a lot of people may have been upset with other creators leaving too and in turn being upset with Genshin for taking away the people that they loved. Yes, I know that doesn't apply to all of you, but I wanted to make this video to say that I'm not upset and that I don't think Arknights is a bad game. In fact, I will stand by Arknights for years to come, telling many that they should try it. It's a great game and it has so many good things. I'm just not enjoying it anymore. Which is fine. I look forward to Enfield and the Arknights anime, and I will cover those two things on this channel in the future. But for now, I'm heavily into Honkai Impact 3rd and Final Fantasy 14, amongst other things. Life is short, so don't spend it doing things you don't want to do that you don't have to do. This is something that's kind of scary to do, leaving the main game of your channel when literally the food you eat comes from YouTube. I can believe in myself because so many of you believe in me, which is something I couldn't do before. It's hard staring at the subscriber count asking yourself how much of those people are truly there for you and not just the type of content you cover and honestly I think I used to care about that kind of thing way too much. Last week I streamed 4 different games on 4 different days and I could never have been happier. I used to check the amount of viewers watching often and it would get to me. It would make me feel down when viewership was lower than normal, but last week, I saw 18 viewers on a stream that I cared about, and that is way lower than normal. But I didn't care. I was just enjoying my time with what I was doing and with the people that was there. I do feel I have evolved in that sense, and that is because of all of you. I want to end this by telling you one last thing. Please go live your life. We are all forced into this life, so don't let someone or something live it for you. Be the you that you want to be. It seems impossible, I know. A lot of things do. But trying and failing will make you happier than never trying at all. That's one of the worst regrets you can have.